how to uh, download and install a CSS dedicated server um, what you first want to do is you're going to want to open up your browser you want to go to Google and type in SRCDS and then you want to go to the first one she would say source dedicated server um, and it loads now when you get to here depending on what operating system you got whether it's Linux or Windows um, click whatever version you got for me it's Windows XP um, what you want to do is you want to click on the hyperlink that says from Valve web server and then download it I'm not going to download it because I've already got it but I will run it um, now what you want to do is you want to just leave it at the welcome screen and you want to go to my computer and you want to go C and then in C you just want to right click new folder and you want to name it SRCDS all in caps once you do that go in there you want to create a new folder so right click new and then you want to create it and you want to name it updater with a capital U once you do that go in there um, go back to your Half-Life dedicated server update tool and um, go next go I agree and where it says destination folder what you want to do is you want to go browse C SCARTS and then you want to go updater and you want to like install it to there all right? so do that I'm not going to do it because I've already got it but um, once you do that it will start to look like that now what you want to do is you want to right click HLDS update tool and you want to go create shortcut and then you want to rename that shortcut you want to name it to install update capital I and a capital U once you do that go to properties and then in the target you're gonna add some commands but what I will do is I'll put it in the description so you can just copy and paste it makes it easier so you don't have to read it anyway once you do that click OK and then install the update so just double click it now this is going to take a while um, depending on if you've got good internet or not but um, if you have ADSL 2 or whatever it should take about an hour but, um, if it says anything about um, what is it? The installation file not found. Dying. It's going to create them. Alright, so if you're not done, pause. Alright, so now when you've done that, what you can do is you go back to uh, go into Orange Box, and it should look like this. Now, what you want to do is you want to right-click the SCART's folder, I mean application, and you want to go create shortcut and you want to call it run with a capital R and you want capital S, capital R, capital C, capital D and capital S and then once you do that what you want to do is you want to right click go to properties and you want to edit the target if you can't read it don't worry I'll put it in the description as well so you can just copy and paste it um, but when you've done that click OK and then run it just to see if it works I already know mine works so it doesn't matter but now what you're going to do is you're going to go back to Google and then once you get there you're going to go you're going to search for uh, hurry up you're going to search for 
CSS server CVRs. So, um, click on the first link. And once you get here, all you need to do is you need to rename your server, you know, to whatever you want. Set your Archon password. Go through the rest of the settings. They're all default, so you can change them if you really want to. But what you need to do once you get down to the bottom, you need to make sure the it's set to generic CFG. And then you go click Run CFG Maker. And then when you get here, what you need to do is you need to copy all this so make sure you copy it all right click copy you want to open note tab you want to right click you want to paste it in there now what you want to do is you want to save as you want to make sure you save it as server dot cfg and then where it says save as type you want to make sure that's on all files and when you do that you want to go to C SCART orange box C strike CFG and then paste it in there, see mine's already there anyway once you do that um, what you need to do now is Uh, you want to go to just to make sure that that CFG is there and it's saved as a CFG so go have a look and I can see that it's saved as a CFG um, uh, now what you want to do is you want to open um, the whoops I shouldn't exit it you want to open the run SCART uh, folder um, application so go into orange box and then run it and once you run it let it do its thing but after that what you want to do is you want to go to www.whatsmyip.org once you go there You'll see up the top your IP, copy it, open a notepad, right click paste and what you want to do is you want to put one of them columns on it and then you want to add the numbers 27015 and then you want to copy it again, exit the notepad, don't save, now you, you paste that to all your like one or two friends and then see if they can join your server um, what you want to do is you want to run the game go servers and then go into LAN and see if it's there if it's there add it to your favorites whatever it doesn't matter go in it and then get your friends to join um, that should be it now the other thing you have to do is make sure your ports have been folded for the game but that's another video tutorial I'll do later. Um, comment, rate, and subscribe.